In 2025, if you're not leveraging voice AI systems in your business to help you automate support, create filters between angry customers and your actual human support staff, to automate sales so that you can book, follow up with, and monetize more of your leads, well, you're probably gonna get left behind. And if you're an agency and you haven't implemented this into your systems to make sure you're getting your clients better ROI, again, you're gonna get left behind. But the one thing that starts to become difficult is actually creating these things. But what if you could actually just have a conversation conversation with the AI itself and it would build the voice AI agent literally all for you. Hi there. So I'm here to help you set up your inbound agent. Should only take a few minutes actually. Um, to give you the best suggestions, tell me a bit about your business. Well, that's what we just launched at Thinker AI. And I just showed a training showing you exactly how we did it and exactly just how cool and good it really is. So without further ado, I want to show you this training we just did on how you can use voice AI to create itself. Talk to the AI and it puts together your entire agent 100% for you. Let's hop over there and get shit done. Cool. All right, guys, we're going to be going over something really cool today. We actually the ability for our AI to make more of itself. Kind of scary, but kind of cool at the same time. So anybody here think it'd be cool if, I don't know, you could just have a conversation with your voice AI and have that actually make your voice AI all pre-built for you exactly how you need it to happen so you don't have to overthink, you don't have to do anything else, and it's just ready to go after a short three-minute conversation. Cool. Well, uh, let me show you something because this is pretty, pretty damn cool. All right, so we just rolled this out inside the system for inbound agents only for right now, but it will be rolling out to everything else soon too. Let's uh, show you what I'm talking about here. So I've been going with Susan as the voice lately. But we did actually fix uh, Marissa, just FYI for everybody who does like Marissa. You guys all got that. We did actually have that correction. So let's go over here. And now you're going to see something really, really cool, which is, uh, oh, look, this little button right here. Anybody actually played with this yet? We just rolled this out. I think yesterday or the day before it, but we're going to play with it. I'm going to show you guys this thing right now. Cool. All right. This is brand new. So let's do this. Hi there. So I'm here to help you set up your inbound agent. Should only take a few minutes actually. Um, to give you the best suggestions, tell me a bit about your business. Like what industry are you in and what does your company do? Yeah, so we're actually a coaching program that helps agencies <laughs> leverage voice AI systems. Um, and incorporate those voice AI systems in order to sell higher ticket, get better results for their clients, and incorporate it into their own businesses as well to improve their client acquisition. Oh, that sounds really interesting. So you're essentially helping agencies use voice AI to boost their sales, improve client results, and even enhance their own operations. Got it. Just to clarify a bit more, are your target customers mainly other agencies, or do you also work with individual business owners? So and how big is your... For the purpose of this one here, uh, this particular one, I just we're focusing just on agencies as our end client. Um, and then how big our team is, is right now we have about 30 different employees and we have about 150 different clients in that program. Oh, wow. That's impressive. So you're focusing solely on agencies for this setup. And with a team of 30 employees and 150 clients in the program, it sounds like you're running a pretty robust operation. Hmm. Let me just make sure I've got this right. Your key activities revolve around coaching agencies to integrate voice AI for better sales and client acquisition, right? And your business name, is it something you've already shared or should I jot that down too? Oh, the business name is the Get Shit Done Program. Got it. The Get Shit Done Program. Love the name, by the way. Definitely makes a statement. So I think I have everything I need about your business now. Let's uh, move towards gathering the other necessary details, shall we? Yeah, sounds good. Perfect. Let's dive in. First up, how will the agent greet callers? It's like, what kind of tone or message do you want to start the conversation with? Um, hmm. Do you have any recommendations? Oh, sure. Since your program is all about helping agencies and has a bold name like Get Shit Done, I'd suggest something confident yet approachable. Maybe something like, hi there. Thanks for calling the Get Shit Done program. How can I help you take your agency to the next level today? It's warm, professional, and aligns with your mission. Does that vibe work for you or would you like to tweak it? No, that's actually perfect. Yeah, let's go with that. Awesome. Glad you like it. So next up, do you want the agent to introduce itself and its purpose? For example, something like I'm a virtual agent here to assist on behalf of the Get Shit Done team. 
Or would you prefer to skip that part? Mm -hmm. No, let's add it in. I like that. Great choice. So the agent will introduce itself as a virtual assistant working on behalf of the Get Shit Done team. Now let's talk about the details the agent should gather from callers. What kind of information would be most helpful for your team? Like their name, agency size, specific challenges, or anything else? Honestly, I like what you just said. So let's go contact information. So name, email, phone number, um, any challenges, right? And then, like you said, the agency size. So let's actually stick with, I don't know, I'll let you decide either how many clients they have or how much revenue they're making, whichever you think is an easier question for it to go. Got it. So the agent will gather their name, email, phone number, specific challenges, and then either the number of clients they have or their revenue, whichever feels more natural in the flow of the conversation. I'd say asking about the number of clients might feel a bit easier and less intrusive. So we can go with that unless you'd prefer otherwise. Yeah, that works. Perfect. Perfect. So the agent will ask about the number of clients they have. Now let's move on to the agent's primary goal. Is it to qualify leads, schedule appointments, provide information, or something else? What's the main thing you want it to accomplish? The main goal here is to make sure that any questions they have are answered, but then to ask the qualifying questions and get them booked on our calendar. Uh, Got it. So the agent's main goal will be to answer any questions the caller has while also asking those qualifying questions and getting them booked on your calendar. That's a solid plan. Now, is there any key information the agent should reference, like details about your program, pricing, or anything else that might help it answer questions effectively? Yeah, let's go, let's add this in. So a few key points. One, we have a, had a marketing agency owners ourselves, the people who run the program, marketing agency owners ourselves for over 20 years, uh, $40 million in agency sales. We've helped over a thousand different people um, and, and start and launch and scale their agencies. We also acquired a multi-million dollar voice AI company. I want to make sure that all those details are in there to, to show our background. Uh, pricing, let's not put anything about pricing. Just say that we have very variants of packages um, to, to fit people wherever they are in their journey. And uh, yeah, just make sure we reference, you know, we help agencies of all sizes and what I told you earlier about what we're trying to accomplish with them. Oh, wow. That's an incredible background. So the agent will reference your 20 plus years as marketing agency owners, $40 million in agency sales, helping over 1000 people launch and scale their agencies and acquiring a multi-million dollar voice AI company. It'll also mention that you offer a variety of packages to fit agencies at any stage of their journey and emphasize your mission to help agencies leverage voice AI for better results. Got it. Now, are there any specific voice interaction guidelines you'd like to set? For example, how the agent should pronounce URLs, handle technical terms, or anything else? Or should we keep it simple and natural? So I'm unsure of what to put in that section. Can you give me some recommendations, please? Of course. For voice interaction guidelines, here are a few suggestions tailored to your business. One, pronunciation of URLs or brand names. If your program has a website or specific terms like get shit done, the agent should pronounce them clearly and naturally. For example, get shit done could be pronounced exactly as it's written, or you could opt for a more formal tone like GSD program if needed. Two, handling numbers. If the agent needs to mention figures like 20 years of experience or $40 million, it should say them clearly and avoid abbreviations like 20M. Three, tone for qualifying questions. The agent should sound curious and supportive, not interrogative. For example, oh, by the way, how many clients are you currently working with? instead of how many clients do you have for avoiding overly technical jargon. Since your audience is agencies, the agent should keep the language simple and relatable, avoiding overly technical terms unless the caller uses them first. Five, empathy and enthusiasm. The agent should sound genuinely excited about helping agencies grow and empathetic to their challenges. Would you like to include any of these or does anything else come to mind? Honestly, all of those sounded like a great idea to have added in there. So let's put all of them in. Perfect. I'll make sure the agent follows all those guidelines, clear pronunciation of URLs and brand names, straightforward handling of numbers, a curious and supportive tone for qualifying questions, avoiding overly technical jargon, and maintaining empathy and enthusiasm throughout. All right, I think we've got everything covered. Let me go ahead and finalize this setup for you. Hang tight. All right, now that we've discussed everything, let's review these settings briefly to make sure everything is just the way you want it. Moving forward? Yeah, makes sense. All right, here's a quick recap of what we've set up. Greeting, the agent will start with, hi there, thanks for calling the Get Shit Done program. How can I help you take your agency to the next level today? 
Introduction. It will introduce itself as, I'm a virtual agent here to assist on behalf of the Get Shit Done team. Information to gather. The agent will collect the caller's name, email, phone number, specific challenges, and the number of clients they have. Primary goal, answer any questions, ask qualifying questions, and book the caller on your calendar. Key information. The agent will reference your 20 plus years as marketing agency owners, $40 million in agency sales, helping over 1,000 people launch and scale agencies, acquiring a multi-million dollar voice AI company, and offering packages to fit agencies at any stage of their journey. Voice interaction guidelines. Clear pronunciation of URLs and brand names, straightforward handling of numbers, curious and supportive tone for qualifying questions, avoiding overly technical jargon, and maintaining empathy and enthusiasm. So does everything look good to go or is there anything you'd like to tweak? Nope, all sounds perfect. Let's roll it out. Awesome. So your inbound agent is now all set up and ready to go. That was pretty smooth, right? Oh, and based on what you've told me about your coaching program for agencies, these settings should work really great for qualifying leads and getting them booked on your calendar. I'm actually pretty excited to see how this performs for you. So you can now go ahead and activate your agent and start taking calls. And hey, if you need any adjustments later on, just give us a shout. You know, we're always here to help out. Take care and good luck. Thank you. And look at that. Did it all, put it all in, ready to go. All you have to do is put the bookings in and stuff if you want it. And then I can say, cool, what did I miss? Not this one owner let's go here and then we say cool let's test the agent you know this because i made it a web widget we're going to put a url in and we can test how good it came out hi there thanks for calling the get shit done program how can i help you take your agency to the next level today yeah um just landed on your website just wanted to know a little bit about the company oh that's great so the Get Shit Done program is all about helping agency owners like you scale and succeed. We specialize in coaching agencies to integrate cutting edge voice AI technology into their operations. This helps with things like improving sales processes, generating leads and boosting overall efficiency. With over 20 years of experience as marketing agency owners and $40 million in agency sales, we've guided more than 1000 individuals in launching and scaling their agencies. Plus, We've even acquired a multi-million dollar voice AI company to provide top-notch solutions. Our program is tailored to meet agencies at any stage of growth, addressing challenges like client retention, lead generation, and operational efficiency. Does that sound like something you'd be interested in learning more about? Yeah, I mean, I landed on your page specifically because of the AI part. I've got a lot of clients right now asking for AI, and I'm really just not sure how to, how to implement it properly to get ROI from it. So, I mean, that kind of sounds like what you guys help with. Absolutely. You're spot on. AI is such a game changer right now, but figuring out how to implement it effectively can definitely be overwhelming. That's exactly where we come in. We help agencies like yours not only understand how to integrate AI into your services, but also ensure it drives real ROI for your clients and for your agency. Whether it's using voice AI to streamline operations, enhance client acquisition, or even create new revenue streams, we focus on strategies that are practical and measurable. It sounds uh, like very, you're already very, ahead very, of the very, curve very, with very clients cool. asking for AI solutions. How many clients? That is cool. Sorry, Jamil said you guys could only hear me on that part. Could you hear the actual agent or just me on that part? Oh, you could? Okay. Yeah, I can hear. All right, perfect. You you could hear the whole thing too, right? <laughs> like where I was actually yeah. doing the thing? Okay, good. Yeah, I cool. So yeah, that is uh, something we just rolled out, guys. That is AI that builds itself. How freaking cool is that? Hey, like, come on, guys. How how freaking cool is that? Uh, let's see. Let's jump into some stuff. Jamil says they could only hear me. Sorry about that, man. I'm not sure why that would be, but it looks like everybody else could hear both. So hopefully in the recording, you'll get to see both. I'll upload that and you'll be able to see that. Um, answering a quick couple of questions inside the chat before I jump to just doing open Q&A. Is setting up the agent co-pilot something we need to train the thinker system on or is it a button? No, it's a button. So right now, as is, um, it is the anytime you go to create a new inbound agent or web widget, it will be right there where I showed you where to click that button at the first. We are going to be rolling this out for everything else too eventually, which will be huge. Right now it's just for the inbound, but it's there for everybody immediately in that uh, in that spot when you go to build it. 
Right. And Mark, you said, does it actually work this fast? Um, I mean, you just saw me do it. That was end to end. So it works as it lurks literally as fast as what I just did uh, with it. Some of the cool things that I said uh, to it that I think that you guys, hopefully you guys picked up on is if I don't know, right? If I don't know certain things like agent guidelines are still new. So I'm really not sure what, what all I should put in there, right? So I asked the web widget or not the web widget. I asked the, the co-pilot to actually give me some information and give me some, some different recommendations. And you can see everything that she said, everything that it's all in there, right? All of this stuff. She gave me a whole bunch of things, clear demeanor, clear pronunciation of names, how to do this, that, the other thing. Super, super helpful because even with me right now, it's my product and I've been, I do this all the time. I don't often even use the agent guideline section yet. So I was able to talk it through and actually get recommendations there for it. Same thing with the intro. So it was like, oh, well, with how badass your thing is, maybe let's talk, let's do the, this intro instead of the other one, right? So it's all at that part. All right. So a couple of you guys are asking, how do I find it again? So you must have missed the beginning of it. So let me just go here again. So when you go here and you add a new agent, right? Let's just do a thing. All right. We click this. As soon as you make a new web widget, a in bio receptionist or uh, both, right? It's right here, right up at the top. And as soon as I click this, it starts the conversation and we'll get that going. So it's all inside of there. Uh, really easy to access and really easy to get it going. Cool. Okay, cool. Talk to you guys then. Bye, everybody. Thank you so much for spending the time to watch that amazing training. Like I mentioned previously, my intention is for you not just to watch that training, but if you got something out of it, if you think this information is useful, I want you to continue that journey with us. And you can do that in a couple of ways. One, I want you to smash that subscribe button so that you get notified every single time we put another one of these out, which will be at minimum once to twice per week. The other thing I want you to do is go ahead and click that next video right there beside you so that you can dive in and get shit done. Hope to see you out there.